Hi, um, this is just a very very small video showing you a new feature we just uh, added yesterday night to the uh, Pandora operating system. It's a small gamma manager where you can set, uh, load, change, save the LCD gamma of the Pandora. So for example you can go to uh, create a, a new gamma setup then you get this picture here that's a nice tool from Notas and you can change the values which will then um, change the gamma of the LCD so you can see here you can do weird things that don't make sense at all but you can change the gamma if you want you can keep that one um, but I don't want that it looks too weird so I'm back to the normal gamma um, So what is this useful for? You have a default gamma which is optimized to the Pandora LCD to make a overall good quality picture. And I also like the uh, TV gamma setting which uh, makes the um, LCD look a bit more like an old uh, CRT TV from the contrast and gamma settings. So um, this is perfect for playing emulators. So let's see, um, you can see the difference in um, Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Okay, this is Sonic the Hedgehog with our TV gamma settings. The colors look much more like it. I remember them on my old TV. Um, i show you the difference in a few seconds to the normal LCD gamma. I don't even know if you can see it really in the video, but it looks kick-ass if you have the real Pandora in your hands. Okay, and here is the same Sonic with the normal um, LCD gamma. It looks much too colorful in my opinion. Doesn't look as nice as if I set it with TV gamma. And that one is my personal favorite. It's a uh, C64 emulator with TV gamma and um, TV scanline simulation. That really looks old school. So Enjoy the, these last screenshots um, for today's new feature and hopefully you can be you will be able to do the same thing at home soon yourself. Enjoy!